guys good morning it's been really really long time without any video I'm so sorry about that but it was a really hard period for me so I couldn't make any video right now I'm going in a special place that place where I will go today it is a forest really ancient forest uh, they made in this forest such a beautiful movie with such a great actor Arnold Schwarzenegger Arnold I'm Arnold Schwarzenegger look at that I'm really Arnold Schwarzenegger we are going to make a video around a thousand meter over the sea Woo -hoo -hoo -hoo! Over the sea we go! Woo! That is the magnificent forest. <coughs> I was uh, I was talking about before, and I want to stop to show you my ugly face and let you see sounds of forest and beautiful video about the place. Look at that. I was walking into the forest and I was looking this kind of tunnel and here the animal been out but here I don't know what happened to him anyway is that that is the nature let's go over with our video I was joking, go on. remember now if it was I'm not sure if it was a uh, Conan the Barbarian or whatever movie but I have uh, like uh, some deja vu about this place right here it looks like a place where they make a movie I don't know it's great my friends it's unbelievable sorry guys I know it's a test it's a test day, but I cannot stop to make a video right here. It's so beautiful, so unbelievable. It looks like, oh, crazy, really crazy.
Hmm. What I see right here. Uh huh. It looks like somebody made. Oh, somebody made a shelter right here. Somebody spent the night. <laughs> oh I think I found the place to make a test. Let me check what's going on here. Oh great, look at this. I guess somebody was already made a fire pit here. Oh nice. Yeah, I was gonna make a test right here. Today I couldn't. I couldn't come in this place and don't make a video, such a beautiful videos, pictures of this amazing place sorry because uh, you spend like five minutes more uh, outside of the contest of the test but how oh, I cannot show you this place it is great wonderful peaceful anyway let's go over Dode and K3 I want to make a test today and perform a test for both knives. Let's start to talk about them. That is Birch, Granadilla, Red Art. This is three laminated steel with a white steel core. Second one, Dode. This handle, I don't remember exactly the name about this material, but anyway, some uh, resin epoxy resin material with some blue stuff inside kv720 in the blade full tang scandi grind the same like the other one let's talk about this knife uh, why i choose this kind of handle right here uh, i designed this handle because i uh, wanted to be uh, a really good pleasure to have a knife into the hand this is like a carving knife so must to be uh, comfortable you must to have a chance to work for a long time carving wood without any problem into the hands so first of all I choose like classic shape like egg for the handle and I choose this kind of uh, dimension it's more or less uh, 10 centimeter because with three fingers you can grab the handle and with the last one you can use it behind like this to have a stop he will never happen because this is uh, only a carving knife but you have a chance to have a stop behind in case of you must do use for some uh, you know dangerous movement that you will maybe cut the fingers because the hand will slide over over the bolster and it's really quite comfortable you can see behind and we we're gonna see after I will perform uh, this with the carving and this is Dode uh, what the purpose of this knife this knife uh, was designed uh, with some uh, with some request of my client and we try to put together a couple of things uh, he asked me about the tip especially the drop point and this belly right here a little bit more uh, uh, you know curvy and you know like not so you know not so like in this way but more vertical let me say and uh, the rest of the knife I designed to have just comfortable grip this is around 12 centimeters it can be maybe a little, little bit uh, small for a big hands but 
you know me I have medium hands and I have still some room right here to put my hand so in somehow I guess will gonna fit fantastic to everyone um, I choose Scandi grind of course uh, K720 the, hand, the um, hedge here is like sharp edge because we're gonna use on the fire still and it's it looks like great uh, also with this material that it sounds like you know like plastic and sleepy not sleepy and slidey uh, but this is not slidey, it's really comfortable grip. I wanted to show you how this knife can be closer to the other knife. Maybe not exactly for carving so special like that one, but it can be really all-purpose knife. We will gonna see now some tests. What is nice to see <clears throat> about this knife, and uh, I'm I'm using uh, this wood is a uh, beech. Uh, <laughs> don't think bad. I'm not in a prostitute forest. I like how he advised me to make this shape, my friend, because you will gonna use this as a look as a tool this kind of uh, tip right here it helps a lot to make uh, this kind of uh, work from the tip down this is not exactly dry eh? this is like uh, almost you know it fell down this tree not long time ago uh, but look because what is the problem? In this way, you will gonna arrive to the hand and hit the wood in this way. And it will not gonna help you a lot to work in this way. But this, this kind of tip right here, it's help you a lot to have this kind of, look, magnificent working on the wood. Will work really easy, really easy and comfortable. Let me check what's going on with the other one. For example, look, I have a problem now because here I arrive down and I will gonna hit here. So in, in this way, it is possible too. But as you see, you know, look, I have the tip, you know, uh, down and I will gonna, you know, it's not so comfortable anyway. I wanna show you something. Uh, look the different of wait this is fresh not too much how is this and how is this I don't know if you were gonna see 
yeah i don't know if you if i can show you but this is white steel this is like shiny and really polish and here too but you know this is really shiny it's unbelievable anyway both they are cutting well let me go over with this one remove some stuck from here to make comfortable handle but look for small carving that is perfect but for this big one it's much more comfortable this knife and much more useful also as you see before it helps you to make some batoning to that this one the small one it cannot help you to make it <coughs> let me just make the last finish here to avoid to have any chips into my hands okay. last part So right now we have our hammer and the we will gonna use right now for a test. I will gonna first split some log because I need to use it for a fire still after. This is dead wood. Let me make it make better. Okay. We're gonna split in four. Okay, let's split also this one that it's a little bit bigger. We're gonna see from here. Let's now make some hard batoning here on this boot. This is old tree. Also this kind of tip, if I will gonna attack the boot in this way, if you can see, it's gonna give a flat surface into the boot so it is also easier to remove a piece of wood like this you can see oh, with the tip uh, too thin it will gonna be impossible to make this kind of work Oh, this handle doesn't give any strange vibration into the hand it is you know quite grippy and comfortable let me make some feather stick
in according with the fact that I'm like a pussy to make feather stick. Anyway, not so bad. As you know, I'm not good fan of feather stick. I mean, oh yes. So sorry for my hands and capacity to make a feather stick, but it will gonna work nice. Let me check how it's working, both of them. As a... They are making a lot of dust. Okay. And let me check. Both of them, they are making good dust. Anyway, this dust, it is good fire starter. It was a mine for the wood, but I wanted to make like some object. Look, unbelievable. This white steel is out of system. It's removing so much material, but really so much. My friend, I really love for carving. I really love the white steel. For me, there is no any other steel that it's performing like him I'm not gonna make handle so amazing because I don't need also a spoon just as like small demonstration how it can work this knife Five minutes maybe. It is not quite finished, but I gonna I have all the time to make it. But I wanna make just a small test. Look at this. And look why I love this kind of steel uh, shape too. First of all, I was gonna use a little bit here on the handle because I want. You see, it's not the same quality. For what I can say, K7 under 20 is unbelievable steel. It's hard steel, whatever. Of course, at the cost, completely different than this one. But white steel? I got the wrong video, uh, the wrong view. Let's go to see now this part that I wanted to show you. Of both knives. How stock, how much stock they remove. So easy. one and this one no not so bad and that's what happened after I'm so sorry but I was out of focus whatever look at this why I like so all I will gonna make some hole right here
I can still get in this position and work as well as a like carving tool but it's not and that is the magic of this uh, shape here Whatever. Ten minutes I have a spoon. This is really small, okay, but you know that's what I wanted to show you. How well can perform this knife? Uh, I can see right here uh, there is some small damage damages on the hedge, but I don't think so. You will gonna see. Let's see. Fortunately, there are small damages. I mean, I can see with the shining of the uh, of the um, of the sun that there is some damage. But whatever, as my always I say about the trick of sharpening a knife into the boot, use your leather sheath to make it cut better and I can see here look at this it's still razor sharp you know uh, it is unbelievable it works really well So guys, what is the impression about the knives? Uh, they are making their job. They are designed to be in the forest. They are designed to get back the hedge if you will gonna overuse the knife really easy. So it will be uh, just a pleasure uh, to work with, with them into the forest. They are, they are comfortable, they are light and you know uh you can you can enjoy your your day into the forest without any problem thank you for uh, joining my channel thank you for follow my video and i hope you will gonna uh, follow me more and also in my instagram page and my facebook page have a nice day guys and goodbye from this amazing view